We are from Samuel Berlin School, and we are going to show you how global warming is affecting polar bears in the Arctic. We have learned a lot about habitats and animals. One of the animals we have learned about is the polar bear. Polar bears live in Canada, Norway, Alaska, Greenland, and Russia. Many polar bears live right in our own province in Churchill, Manitoba. Polar bears spend most of their time on sea ice because they need to hunt seals for their food. Polar bears are actually marine mammals, which means they spend more time at sea than they do on land. Polar bears need ice to hunt. You might be wondering what all of this has to do with global warming. What happens to ice when it warms up? It melts. Global warming means that the Earth is warming up too much. This is bad because the ice platforms that polar bears need is melting faster than it ever has before. When polar bears are off the ice, they don't eat. They have to wait until ice forms again so they can find seals. In 2010, polar bears were off the ice for 160 days. 40 years ago in 1970, polar bears were off the ice for only 120 days. You do the math, that's 40 days longer that polar bears have to go without eating any food. Scientists who study polar bears are finding that they are getting too thin, are in poor health, and the mom polar bears are having less polar bear cubs. More and more polar bears are dying because they have no ice to go hunt, on, hunt seals. No ice equals no seals equals no polar bears. So what can we do about this? We, we took the bike walk girl survey at our school. We found out that our class does a pretty good job of wa walking, biking, rollerblading, scootering, or skateboarding to school. 47% of our class biked, walked, or rolled to school. 43% of all the students in the Royal School Division biked, walked, or rolled to school. But in all of Manitoba, only 35% of students biked, walked, or rolled to school. Come on, we can do much better than that. And kids keep getting rides to school. This makes a lot of pollution from all those cars. This means the gas is put into the environment um, from those cars causes global warming. Remember, global warming melts ice that polar bears need. At least two-thirds of the world, the polar bears live in Canada. That means that we are responsible for taking actions and doing something to stop global warming. We are challenging you to think about more active ways you can get to school that won't pollute the earth. What can you do to make a difference? Please bike, walk, or go to school.